things like this where, you know, the team is better than you and, um, you know, from start to finish. And you just keep fighting as much as anything. You want to see how a team will handle this situation, especially, you know, after the half when uh, we're really down quite a bit. You want to see how guys would fight the second half. And I thought our team fought hard. Uh, we got some other players in there that got an opportunity to play. And so, you know, another, this is really a tough loss. And uh, we're down to one more game in our football season, and uh, we're playing our rival, and hopefully we'll get a couple of guys back and be able to play better than we did today. Take your question. What, what the Storm Bowls on the offense were, what they were doing and what you were doing? I think it's, I think Bob's a combination of both. I mean, starting off with, they're an outstanding football team. In all areas, all three areas, uh, they were better than us, and they dominated us up front on both sides of the football. So, the way they started the game, going right down the field, we had an opportunity, a third down play where we got a penalty. From there, it, you know, it was kind of roller, you know, it was downhill. What happened with Jace? I'm sorry. What happened with Jace? Just you talking about play today? No, today and what happened when he got knocked down. Oh. Um, you know, play of the day, you know, it's tough for everyone, but, um, you know, I don't even know exactly what the injury was. On, you know, he took a shot on the sideline, fell on the concrete there a little bit. Well, we knew our other players were out. Early and couldn't practice until late in the week. So we knew there's a, I mean, Chase had a full week, though. He got all the reps this past week. I think you evaluated, you know, the entire football team didn't play well enough. Chase was a part of that. Yeah, if you're looking for positives, there were, you know, two scores on the board. So, uh, uh, great hit by Stanley Green. And, uh, yeah, you're always preaching, taking the ball away and scoring on defense. So, to be able to get that, good play by both of those guys. And, of course, the other score. You know, Cam Miller. Cam Miller has been on the looks, you know, down running the scout team most of the year. So to get an opportunity to do that for his carry, you know, really excited for him. No, our guys were close, you know. Yeah. Uh, so hopefully, didn't make this one, but uh, we have a little bit of time before we play our next game. Um, I was going to talk about Chase anyway, though. Okay. But uh, he's been, you know, meant an awful lot to our program. Um, his role has changed throughout the year. You know, our quarterback, we asked him to move into a different role. He accepted that. Tight end, tight end ace back, whatever we wanted him to do. That's what he said to me when I told him. Uh, so it was only, you know, you wanted, it's good that he got another chance to play quarterback. And like our football team today, you know, a lot of good things that happened to us. But, um, uh, of course, we'll remember him for this, this effort. You know, it's tough when you have been haven't been getting a lot of reps and right. in a week's time trying to get ready to play an, a great team like Ohio State. So it's meant a lot to our program. Does that team look like a Final Four team in two years later? Well, uh, I would definitely say so. Um, and, I mean, you look at how Ohio State has played all year. I mean, they're one of the best football teams in the country. It's as simple as that. And, uh, you know, of course, just going to our conference in, as a whole. I mean, the, the win of our conference, you know, should, of course, have a chance to play for the national title. So we'll see how that all plays out. When it rains like that, is there anything you can do? Or just no, I mean, both teams are in, playing in the same environment, so it doesn't really – I don't know if it hurts or helps one team more than the other. I think once it gets down to it, the best football team normally wins, and they were the best football team. Uh, great, you know, great size, ability, you know, across the board, you know, tackle to tackle, outstanding tight end. You look, go across the board. Uh, good runners, not just not one. And you expect that from, you know, an Ohio State team. Last time I was in this stadium, there was a great runner, Eddie George, you know. So you expect that. Archie Griffin, it's been a great run, a few great runners come through here. Um, and they have some really good ones right now. Skill guys, too. And of course, it all starts with the quarterback. You couldn't use cameras yesterday. There were cameras, yet they were not available. No.
not available today or, or not available. Well, as we're building, it's a process for us. Um, you know, come into this environment, which was new for the, for a lot of guys, but uh, to see where we would like to be someday. Uh, again, when you're playing one of the best teams around in our conference, this is what we'll be shooting to be uh, in a position where we can compete and give a, a program like Ohio State a better game than we did today. I think that's what most of our guys guys need to see how much we have, how much work we have in front of us too. This just didn't happen overnight. Yes, he did. Yes. Thank you.